so in this video we are going to make a splash screen for our app so as we all know that flutter has a default splash screen when it loads an app and it's a default white screen and we are going to modify that and uh, we will be making our own splash screen and i'm going to use an image for that so first of all i'm going to need a package the flutter native splash okay and uh, where I've just copied it and uh, you know got my dependencies so the next thing I want over here is that I want to create a flutter native splash uh, dot yaml file okay so I can also put this file this uh, code and uh, this code in my pubspec.yam file but I don't need to do that and I will create another file you know it's a good way to uh, you know organize our code so it has all the attributes that we want to change for a, a splash screen so I've just copied this I have made a flutter native splash the sham file and I've put all that code in here and I've just changed the color and uh, the next thing I have done over here is that I have given a I have uncom uh, I have uncommented the image tag and I have given the uh, assets splash dot png. So in the splash assets, I have created I have copied a file. I have just created this icon for myself. So yeah, I'm going to do uh, to use this. So this is the basic requirement. So the next thing I want over here is that if you uh, read the documentary in doc documentation so in the documentation they have said that if you use uh, another yaml file or you have you copied the this code this code in another file so what we want to do is that we want to give the path of that file okay so what we are going to do is just copy it okay paste it in our terminal and the next thing i want over here is that i want to copy the flutter native splash and I'm going to copy the path okay so let me just you know get the absolute path and remove this and I will put it here and I'll just wait for it so yeah let's just wait for it so this is this will be the basic implementation of a splash screen and if you want to okay so parse color invalid color value so it's given an invalid color value I'm going to you know just keep the default color as for now I have wanted to change it but let's just you know leave it as of now and run this command again Okay, so the flutter native splash.cham file contains the, all the attributes that we want for our splash screen. Okay, so it can uh, the attributes can be changed and we can do whatever I want we want. But I have done the basic implementation of that, and here it's showing that native splashes splash complete. Okay, so I'm just going to run my app in both my flutter mobile and flutter web and i'm going to show you right now so my app has started in my web and uh, yeah it's just showing so let's just wait for it to restart so my app has loaded and it's showing the splash screen and uh, when it's done the when it start when it has done loading it will just show the ui of our app And you can change the background color of uh, this splash screen from the pubspec dot, dot uh, the flutter splash dot yam file. To do that, you can just change the color to whatever you want. I didn't do it because I wanted to make that. Uh, I wanted to keep everything simple, but the color can be changed as well. okay so for some reason it's taking too long it shouldn't do this okay 
uh, viewport flutter web is uses its own viewport configuration for flutter okay so let's just restart our app okay so as you can see it first shows the splash screen and then it shows the ui of our app okay so it's working in our web app and this is okay let me just you know enable it okay so in our mobile app i want to do the same so let me just open my app and uh, okay so let me just open my app in my phone and then i'll show you okay so yeah it has shown the splash screen and then it shows the ui of our app so that's all for now thank you